So on this quote board behind me, it says, beautiful girl, you can do amazing things. And I 100% believe that about you. I believe that you are capable of change. I believe that you can reach your goals. I believe that you are more than what people say that you are and what you even feel that you are. And I just wanted to shed some light on why I am doing this newsletter, why I am kind of ramping up the new year in this way, because it's so important. So what I'm doing with this newsletter series is just kind of shedding some light on reasons why you failed in the past. And I know from my personal experience, I try to compartmentalize my life all the time into work, physical fitness, nutrition, this, that, the other thing, and it stressed me out. I felt like all of the pieces of my life were in total disalignment, were in total disarray, and it was like a mind puzzle trying to put them back together. Um, it was impossible to do on my own. It was impossible because I had no idea where to start. But what I want for you is to stop making New Year's resolutions and actually stick to behaviors and habits that are, that are going to change your lifestyle. So this way you don't have to come up with a New Year's resolution every year. You don't have to suffer from you know the critics that are always saying, oh, what are you doing this year? I bet you're gonna fail this one too. Um, no, I do not accept that for what it is. And if you are in that place of just being tired of setting New Year's resolutions, you are in that place of how am I going to change? I've tried so many times and it has not worked. There is hope, okay? There is hope because what I'm going to do after this newsletter series is set you up to succeed. Um, I am just really encouraged, as you can probably tell, to be in this place of new beginnings and of creating and of caring for people in the way that I want as a coach. So just be very, very aware and excited for what's to come because I want this year to be different than any other year. If you've seen those 10 year decade challenges, they've been so encouraging of seeing someone from where they were to where they are now. Um, but think of this as your new year decade challenge, right? It's not about the next month or two where you're gonna see the real transformation. It's gonna be over the next year, over the next two years, over the next 10 years. If you are going to change your habits and behaviors very, very slowly, they're going to build, they're going to compound. And all of a sudden, when you look back over the last couple of years, in a few years, you'll see that it was so well worth it. And it was so worth it to not give up. Even if you had one bad day, that doesn't mean you have to, you know, go off the wagon, right? I used to have that mentality of going on and off, on and off, and it was exhausting. And it was like living a double life. So this year we are going to dig our heels in. We're going to do the work and we are going to succeed. And I know that because I've done it myself and now I wanna help you do it. So please stay tuned for the next newsletter coming out this week, um, just explaining a little bit more about what you can do right now to prepare for the next couple weeks. I hope you guys have a great week. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your night and I will talk to you later this week.